The new fella. Howdy. Howdy back at you. If you're looking for a side, you might want to trek to the higher edges of the canyon. Is it worth the hike? I wouldn't know. Never been there myself. They're too steep to climb. And there's a lot of creatures up there. Some of them won't even eat you. Sounds like paradise. It's a tough climb, but you'll find a way up. And you'll see the true majesty of Kobo. I just know it. Welcome, welcome. Make yourself at home. Strangest thing. I was enjoying a lively constitutional earlier today. Really? You? I deserve that. Anyway, I saw the strangest duo putting around the far side of the valley. One was tall and quiet, one short and babbling. They had stopped to inspect some beastly carcass. This had you written all over it. I deserve that. You know, you've got a core world air about you. It's becoming. You from the core? Guilty as charged. I studied the galactic economy with some of the greatest minds of Coruscant. Then watched those same minds ooze into obscurity while real opportunity whistled by. Real opportunity? Oh, you know, tax-free trade, extrajudicial imports, what have you. Oh, you mean smuggling? What I mean is that the galaxy is begging to fill your pockets if only you'll play its game. Another time. Oh, hey! It's you! I saw you tearing through the woods. Remember me? Name's Toa. I'm a historian. Freelance, these days. Cal, also freelance. You planning on doing more exploring? Of course. This is my first time beyond the Mid-Rim, but I can already tell this place is a trove. Centuries ago, folks couldn't wait to scratch out a living under a new sky. And hell, they sure chose a vibrant world. Vibrant, huh? Hey, let me know if you find any more of those chambers, yeah? Will do. Cal, I... I heard about a meditation chamber. You gonna check it out? Oh, I wish. It takes some serious acrobatics to access it, and... <laughs> I could give it a shot, Toa. A shot? This coming from the guy who scales basalt pillars in the time it takes me to date my field journal. <laughs> Happy hunting, you two. We'll talk soon. Well, keep. Huh. What can I get you? How about putting a lock on the door so that slimy wretch won't wander back in? Turtle? <laughs> no can do. We need all the business we can get. And how about paying off that brute and his gang so I can drink undisturbed? Sorry, Big Wheel. We're not exactly flush with credits. And I don't think Ravis is on the tape. <sighs> Figures. Another drink it is. 
Word is there's a traveling troubadour and a DJ droid from the core worlds on Kobo. Not what I expected you to say. Any idea why they're there? They've hiked out onto the valley plateau to sample the sounds of the wild. And the sounds of the wild can come from creatures that kill you. Can't drop those beats if you're dead. I'll see if I can find them. I suspected as much. Cal, how do you and Grease meet? I was working on Brock as a scrapper. Grease gave me a lift when I needed it most. The way he tells the story, seems you gave him a lift too. That's so. He never said the words exactly, but when I wanted to turn that back room of yours into storage, <laughs> he threatened to replace me with a gontroid. People show their affection in strange ways, don't they? Yeah, Monk. I guess they do. Grease and the others are still waiting for you at the landing pad, you know. That your ship outside? Yeah. What's it to you? Panagel will be pleasantly surprised when someone brings some class to this rock. Was that a compliment? Was it? I wish those raiders would just leave us alone. Every time they smash things up, I'm the one who's got to fix them. The outpost is lucky to have you. Sure. I just wish I could build something that couldn't be knocked down, that's all. Yeah, me too. It's lonely patching up the outpost on my own. Be nice if I had a partner. Monk, you back there? You look tired. Take a load off. If you need a hand, we're an oasis in the sand. And if you die in a thirst, well, our drinks, they ain't the worst. And if you're running from a blaster, better run a little faster. Run to Pylon Saloon, and we hope we see you soon. It was good to see you. Let's see what we find up here. I gotta confess something. Here we go. That tech I tried to sell to Ravis, there's more of it in the valley. A building right in the center. You can't miss it. So I was thinking, you head there and check things out and we split whatever you find 50-50. We'll see, Turgle. Was that your ship that flew by the cantina? That was the Stinger Mantis, all right. Technically, it's Grease's ship. Grease has told me some real tales about that thing. I wouldn't take Grease's stories too seriously. Oh. So I suppose it isn't true that Grease once flew the Mantis into the heart of the Haxian Brood asteroid base? Guns blazing to save you from a death match? No. Oh, actually, yeah. That happened. Not bad, huh, buddy? Conditions are perfect for a garden. All right, let's try planting these seeds we found. A 
And now we wait. Here's your new home. I think they'll like it there, buddy. Some striking variants here. What do you think, BD? Here? Plant this here. We're off to a pretty good start here, buddy. Wanna plant some seeds? This would be a good place for it. One of my favorites. This will be useful. It's a deal. You like that one. Here you go. I knew you'd pick that up. Can't go wrong with this. All sales.
try some new components. A lot of raider activity these days. How are you two holding up? Us? We're always yeah, fine. Yeah, we're fine. It's the others I worry about. You do? That's kind of you. Yeah. We worry that if they keep being such cowards, they'll be dead by tomorrow. And then we'll have no one left to make fun of. To be honest, that's really what gets us through the day. Mocking turgles like drinking water. And shaking our heads at that whiny slump Moran. I'm starting to feel better already. I guess some things never change. And that's how we like it. So long. Ah, you troublemaker. Hey, you! You're the one taking shots at the Raiders, right? That's me. Bad idea. The Raiders have got eyes all over the Reach. What kind of eyes? Ravis has got a watchtower in the valley. Maybe I'll check it out. Figured you'd say that. Head towards the spires. Can't miss it. Of course, they won't miss you either. You know, because of the watchtower. You didn't try anything brave at that watchtower, did you? Not yet. Smart. Ready to ride. Hello there. Up! <laughs> Twenty cycles ago. Heard this town was nothing but a few shacks. Now look at it. Yeah. Sometimes I wish I could go back there. See what it was really like to rough it. You could always head into the wilderness and start your own town. I think I'll stay here, thanks. Come on, Neko. They don't look friendly. All you, BD. Always on point. Faster now.
know your way around Kobo, don't you? Here for the soundscape, too? Hey, back. I heard there was someone collecting samples up here. That's right, man. Didi's been all over these glider calls. <laughs> oh, it's sounding great. You know, Kailun Saloon down in the outpost is starving for some live entertainment. Hmm. Might not be a bad call. Didi swore one of those beasts gave him some side eye. <laughs> yeah, we're in. We'll catch you back at the outpost. See you there. Dee and I are just gonna finish up here. <laughs> Chill, Dee Dee, I ain't rushing you. That's it. That's a good boggling. Must be the way out. Their data disk. <clears throat> no scanning, okay, BD?
intruder. it up. Maybe we can find another way in. You know your way around Kobo, don't you? Now that better? There's a good Neko. You just stay here now, all right? And be quiet. I'm sure there's nothing to worry about. Come on, Echo. Here we go, buddy.
Good, Neko. Yeah! That's quite an arsenal you've got there. Arsenal? What? Why do you ask this of Gara? Business is none of yours. I'm not here to make trouble. What do you plan to do with all this? I present as gift to Ravis. Great tribute, yes? Tribute? You mean you want to join the Raiders? Join the Raiders, yes. No more prospecting, no longer other saying weak of Gara. Much glory and blood with Ravis. The Raiders are dangerous and not known to strike deals. Danger, eh? Gara gorge self on danger? Gara live for thrill of kill, but you are not killer like Gara. You are deaf to the call of battle. All right, I guess I'll leave you to it. You do not want to join the Raiders. Gara doesn't want to join the Raiders. The Raiders are unreliable. It's too dangerous to bargain with them. Yes, Raiders? Not to be trusted. Too dangerous for Gara. No, no, deal is off. Too risky. Contraband. Here, you take. Gara no wants. All right then. Are you just gonna leave all this here? You take contraband. Gara gets rid of rest. Too risky for keeps. You here still? You take contraband. You leave. All right, got it. This is all a big misunderstanding. Honest, you gotta let me go. Oh yeah. Why should we? Uh, I can be of use to you. Yeah, 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 that's it. Whatever you want. I'm your frog. Oh, we'll see. Boss is looking for something. Find it, or we'll find you.
Time to go. It's okay, BD. We'll find another way. Off we go. Huh? Did you do that? Wait, what? No! <laughs> hey, BD! Take a ride, BD. Stop here. Would you kindly assist us? Perhaps there's something we could do for you in return. You got it. trying to communicate is that we would prefer not to die out here. Here, my warrior friend. I haven't seen such fighting since the championship. We are in your debt. What are you doing out here? We were out looking for the biggest, strongest beasts to fight each other. Winner take all. Within our Hollow Tactics game table, of course. Hollow Tactics, huh? That's right. And you have just helped us gather beastly data for our game. Just as soon as we find a place to set up shop, of course. My friend might be interested. He runs Pylon Saloon. Ah, yes. The saloon at Rambler's Reach. That dumb? I didn't realize it was open. Well, tell you what. We're more than happy to bring hollow tactics to Pylons. Good liven up the place. Let us make haste, Tully Moo. All things in their own time, Bima. See you around.
easy, Neko. Here we go. Oh, quit complaining. I'm almost done. <laughs> there. Good as new. Whew, what a wingspan. I see why they call you gliders. But you could fly around all the Kobo, couldn't you? Okay, off you go. Don't be a stranger. Come on, Neko. Don't kill me! Kill you? I just saved your fool leg. Who are you anyway? I'm Turgle. Well... If you won't keep breathing, you best follow me. This is Raider territory. Steady now. Well, you got a mean look to you. I do? Yeah. Like you're not afraid of nothing. Maybe you can find out what all this fuss is about. There's a shack nestled way out near the caverns. Folks call it Key's Workshop. What's in the workshop? Misery. And maybe treasure, or so I hear. If you're in the area, could be worth a visit. Good, Neko.
Gulu, Guido, what's going on? Just bemoaning the sorry state of affairs in this place. What did the Raiders do this time? No, not them. We were talking about how things ain't like the good old days. When we started out here, life was grand. The place was nearly empty. Barely anyone to bother you. Sounds like paradise. Well, it's the way of the galaxy. The only constant is change, and everything gets worse with time. Yeah, and there's always one Turgle everywhere you go. <laughs> <laughs> So long. Come on, Neko. Come on! Hi there. <laughs> don't mind the beast. She don't like strangers. The mountain don't neither. You be careful. I'll try. Thanks. Prospector's folly, we call it. Pretty treacherous. Crawling with all kinds of dangers. Sounds like our kind of place. <laughs> There's stuff beyond these crags that make your blood run cold. Oh, uh, we could tell you some stories. There's a fish tank down in Pylon Saloon that could use some attention. Pylon Saloon? That will have infested watering hole down in your valley. All right, all right. You know, yeah. Ah, fine, twist my arm. I'll do it. Meet me at the saloon and we'll appraise this so called tank. Guess not. You're the aspect of a fish lot. And uh, lucky for you, we're perched just above the layer of the sea fish. Sea fish, huh? That's right. An impossible catch. No fisher in the right mind would pursue such a quarrelsome foe. No fisher, but Scuba Stev.
Not a bad find. See what's up ahead, buddy. the rewards, Shanna. Come on! Okay. Great find. Passing through, officer. <laughs> Nothing that ain't made a Dura steel is passing through this electron wall. Weapon hot, sir. Let's shoot him before he gets ideas. Negative. We've got our orders. Sure, you can't make an exception. You smell that, scum? That's Imperial air you're breathing. So get back before I forget my orders and we see how tough you really are. You will lower the shield. I. I already showed you my authorization. You already showed me your authorization. Uh, sir? TK-783 to base command. Lower the shield. What? Wait, what? The shield is down! Blast him! Gotta unlock this. Thanks. Let's take a look.
Oh, oh well, we have to wait here. Don't we have better things to do? We could set it on fire, you know, to pass the time. Didn't they already check this place? 